What's up everyone in the true spirit of the holidays. It's Mark Patterson show and we are giving away my 12 ways to finish the year strong. You know, 12 days of Christmas. So let's get started with part one. There will be two videos to this. We're gonna go over the first six and then we'll release seven through 12 tomorrow. So check it out, make sure you watch the videos. There will be a bunch of links below, so I'll reference them and uh, make sure you click on them, check out what I got to offer and uh, happy holidays. So let's start off with number one. How do we end our year amazing? Contact all those clients that you sold the house to this year. If they bought, if they sold, whatever the situation was, contact them, thank them. It can be a quick video text message. It doesn't have to be anything serious. And that brings me to round number two. Hopefully you got some referrals this year, whether from other real estate agents in other cities or clients of yours. Send them a thank you. Same thing, quick video message. Hey, I just want to say thank you for uh, referring that client over. I truly appreciate it. If I have anyone moving to your area or whatever situation it is, I'm going to think of you. That goes a long way, especially when it's during the holidays. Number three, buy your top five clients New Year's gifts. So it's only five clients. Maybe get them a bottle of champagne. Look at who your top five are. Maybe people that refer you business, someone who's been a repeat offender that have bought you a lot of properties from you. Uh, go after your top five and buy them some gifts. Number four, contact all the people that were home shopping last year and didn't buy. Right now is a great time to be writing offers. Yes, it's the holidays. Yes, we got January, it's a little bit slower, but you know what that means? Less competition. So if you can chat with those buyers, let them know, hey look, there's less competition right now. This is a great time to put in offers. It's going to solidify that relationship. Plus, hopefully they get their offer accepted this time. Uh, or maybe they came around and got more realistic and they realized prices weren't going to drop. So check that out. Number five is review your finances. Yes, I know that it's great to make money, but if you're not doing it right and you're not saving and you're spending too much, if you make a million dollars and you spend a million dollars, you're going to be broke. You're going to go crazy just working and working, working. Something that I do, I review my finances every single month. And then also get yourself that business credit card you've always been looking for. I have a link in the below. Uh, I have an American Express Platinum card. Trust me, we fly everywhere first class for free because of all the air miles and they directly transfer mile to mile. Uh, tons of great stuff on that Amex Platinum. So check it out. And number six, the final one for today is donate all those clothes. Donate that laptop, donate all that stuff that you don't need and get that end of the year tax right off. So when you do a donation, they give you a slip, save that slip and you can have your accountant give that evaluation and that can be a write off for a donation. So those are my six tips. We're gonna continue the 12 days of giving tomorrow and uh, check out any of the links below. We got it all set up for you. Chat soon guys.